make a difference for one person can mean the world to them. And from there, when you realize that you can make a difference for one person, you can make a difference for a second person, a third person, and eventually the world. I spent two weeks up in the Canadian Arctic, um, sailing off the coast of Baffin Island, learning about the, the beauty of the Arctic, the people of, of the north, um, and the richness of the culture and the environment there. And I came back very changed and wanting to do something to um, protect this uh, beautiful place and beautiful culture up north. Food is a basic necessity, like shelter. But food is so much more than just a basic necessity as well. It is something that connects us all and that is very much tied to culture, tied to place, um, tied to history, tied to the environment. When a girl can't go to school for five days a month, that has a huge impact on her academic performance and it has a huge impact on her future academic opportunities and her work opportunities. So simply providing a girl with the means to manage her body would just create such a change systemically. When I was young and I was in Thunder Bay working at a heritage farm and we were teaching children about agriculture and I taught the concept of sustainability using a stick and some dirt. And I got some really young kids to become very excited about that. I heard them talking about it to their teachers and parents after. So I, I thought, if I can get kids to be that excited with uh, a stick and some dirt, if I continued on with it and had a little bit more resources, perhaps I can do even a bit more. What makes a good leader? Time, patience, perseverance, passion, Anyone can be a leader. So oftentimes that is our biggest barriers because we think we lack the skill set. But you learn by doing and that's the best way to learn and learn how you can make a difference.